population in Huntsville continues to grow, so does the need for health care and nurses. A program for licensed practical nurses may just be the shot in the arm to bring some relief in that area. News 19's Mariah Wiggs joins us now live to tell us about that new program that begins this week. Mariah? The new licensed practical nurses program between Huntsville Hospital and Drake State Community is laying the foundation for better health care in the community while also playing a part in reducing that nursing shortage. 19 students are suiting up to become licensed practical nurses. <laughs> a ribbon was cut at the Huntsville Hospital Training Center to celebrate the program that starts Wednesday. The LPN launch program, conducted by Drake State Community and Technical College, provides financial assistance from Huntsville Hospital for tuition, books, and fees. In return, the students will gain three years of experience as licensed practical nurses by working at the local hospital. Karika Myhand has been a medical assistant for the past six years. After facing challenges getting accepted into nursing school, she's finally achieved her goal and is ready to take on the course. I want to retain all the knowledge I can, and I want to I want to be a good nurse. You know, I know the last couple years has been rough for nurses, so I want to be able to get back in that field and really just blossom. Drake State President Patricia Sims says with better training comes better health care for patients. Good health care is not just being well trained, but having caring nurses. The benefit is the high quality patient care, high quality health care for all of our citizens. The nursing shortage in the state of Alabama has added an extra strain on hospital staff as they continue to treat a high number of patients. The demand to make it easier for those interested in nursing programs has also grown. Sim says this partnership is the ideal example of how education institutions and business community partners can all work together to address the challenges faced in the area. It's a win-win. We provide jobs, career opportunities, and we provide the health care that's needed for our community so that we can continue to enjoy a good quality of life in North Alabama. Several classrooms and labs have been set up for students to receive lectures and conduct exam trainings. Now, sessions will begin here at the Huntsville Hospital Training Center on Wednesday for the 19 students. Huntsville Hospital President and COO Tracy Dottie says they hope to have 25 more students join the program in the spring. Live in Madison, I'm Mariah Wiggs, News 19.